guys. Yes, I know. This is a weird title. I've never done anything like this before. Anyways, it's been about a week since I've done any videos. Well, anyways, I want to tell you a story, and this is my story. But first, I want you to think about a few things. Two things to be exact. Now, you have a choice here. You got a choice to stay or you got a choice to leave. This is your choice. What you want to do. Well, on top of that, I want you to think about exactly why and how mainly why you're here why are you watching my ch uh, my channel and why you're watching the videos that I'm doing like are you here for me as a person are you here for my content are you here for my voice or are you here for the information like I said, this is your choice. You either here, you stay, or you leave. If you have stayed this far, I'm going to be telling you my story. That's what's been going on with everything that's been happening in the past three months. <clears throat> First off, I'm going to start with the games, events, and everything and my alliance and what's been going on um as you can see here i'm gonna go in my alliance thing here i've got about 40 members left in my alliance now i'm not gonna get off to that at first um <clears throat> i know a lot of you are probably gonna hate me after this which i don't blame you but it's your choice to stay or leave. I gave you that choice. Don't like it. You don't have to be here. Anyways, well, I want to start off with the events of State of Survival and everything that's been going on and how repetitive it's been um, for me, like in general. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of you think it's been pretty repetitive and annoying such as the events that's been going on um with um like the trap it's mainly the the events that you do such as the thanksgiving events and stuff like that christmas all the uh chinese events the the new events such as the s celestial um gods events such as you know, Capcorn, um, Sagittarius, Scorpio, and all the other ones. Uh, they've been doing a few events like that. I think I named mostly all of them that they did. Anyways, it's pretty repetitive. You know, you do that small event. You pretty much have to pay for the rest to get a skin. Which, you end up paying $100 anyways. Um... That shit's getting pretty repetitive, um, such as the trap times, the reservoir times, um, a lot of that has changed, especially the reservoir. Um, I like the fact when they first changed it to the weekends, so everybody has a chance to, like, uh, I don't know, be in, you know, the reservoir raid, because there's a lot of people working. I understand that. Then they changed it again to where they have Sundays on it now. Uh, it used to be Friday or Saturday. Now it's on Sundays as well. Well, anyways, um, this is going to lead towards my alliance as well. <clears throat> so three months ago, pretty much when it started to be where they pretty much doubted me, like, my activity so-called activity well anyways before those three months i was pretty much running trap and stuff like that 
I was, um, you know, we were getting R fours in. We were getting more stuff like that. I mean, this was this was when way before three months ago. This was probably another probably another four maybe. I don't know whatever the server the date of the server was um, <clears throat> but and it just got to the point where we got more events uh, we needed more R4s we needed more people to help with the events then uh, slowly but surely I stopped end up doing the events you know leading the events and I ended up need to come in to like just join them um, and you know that's where it became so i stopped leading events which was kind of cool because it gave me you know not that much you know i don't have to exactly be on on time stuff like that but i was still on 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 time but and um it got to the point where they changed the time of the events to where I pretty much couldn't join Trap. Um, they set Trap 2100, which is in UTC time is 1 p.m. for me. Um, I'll live somewhere in California, obviously. Um, if you don't want to know what time I do my Trap, I don't really care. Anyways, um, they moved that to that. Um, they also moved Reservoir Raid to Sunday um, 2100 as well. I had days off um, for Sunday. Then it got to the point where I couldn't have my days off there. Then they upped the time on that as well. <laughs> Which, I mean, they, I mean, Mopar, Z-Ripper, all the, all the R4s I had, they took over Reservoir Raid because I pretty much didn't know what to do with it. So I pretty much gave it to them and we worked it out and stuff, but it got pretty bad after that. Like, for me, I guess, because I wasn't in the event anymore because they scheduled a higher time. I told them what times I work, I told them, you know, when I'm available, I told them, you know, I told them all this. And yet, they still didn't make time to schedule it for me um, to join them and stuff. And they complain about me not joining the events. Well, look at you. You didn't, you know, follow up on your side. You didn't do anything to get me in. Well, you pretty much stabbed me in the back, so I don't care <laughs> at this point. And um, it then it got pretty bad to where the trap was like that. I I tried to go on trap. It's set at the same time. Now I got it to 1900, where it's like 11, 10 o'clock in the morning for me. I got an hour before work. You know, probably almost two hours before work. I can do trap, um, you know, just when I can, and, uh, and then that's the current state of right now, pretty much, with the 40 people I have left, including me, and, uh, <coughs> and, it, like, I'm joining trap now, like, a lot more often than I did before. <coughs> I told them. But they don't listen. They're pretty much blindsided me. Um, they took over the events. Um, you know, stuff like that. <clears throat> I mean, you guys probably say, well, you know, they need to join or uh, what's their side of the story? Yeah, I know. I do see both sides of the story, but like, I mean... <clears throat> I told you my schedule, I told you what time I work, you know, all stuff like that. Hold on, guys. Something's stuck in my throat. I don't know what it is. I can feel it. But anyways, um, it's this, it's stupid. And, uh, 
So this is going to be three months ago, pretty much, when they pretty much started to not give me the time of day. And I'm like, okay, like, they don't respond to me. I mean, I say, oh, hey, how are you? Blah, blah, blah. I barely, like, probably an hour later, I'd be like, oh, hi, I'm pretty good. I'm like, okay, it's unusual. And they're on at the time when I say this. I'm like, okay, that that that's cool too. I'm like, sure, all right, whatever. And so it became like that for the past three months. Then I think last month, yeah, last month they got to where it was like one part one of my leaders was uh, my r4 leaders was like how attached are you to the r4 r5 title it's like it's not because i'm attached to it i pretty much told you at the beginning that i'm gonna be r5 until the end i said this and this was when the server first started so this is a long time ago shit changes i understand but still i kept that a thing now um so when they left it was state versus state and it was my birthday at this point i didn't felt like I needed to tell them that I'm not going to be on when it's my birthday. I pretty much, they can fucking shove a bigger stick up their ass, pretty much. Whatever stick they have up their ass still. And I didn't say that, but that's my mind. I don't want to fuck up my birthday. So I, you know, pretty much did what I did. Enjoyed my birthday. Um, that was the first time we lost state versus state against 76, which was pretty sad. We were winning. I would check up here and there, but I would never talk. I'd be on like for five minutes and just like, oh, okay, whatever. It's my birthday. I'm not going to be on during my birthday unless I had something planned, which sometimes I did. But anyways... So, uh, after State vs. State, a few hours later, they messaged pretty much everyone, blah, 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 um, saying that they're leaving, we're not doing this, uh, and a few people apparently think I don't exist. Like, um, there is a lot of Alliance people saying who's Apocalypse, which is my in-game title in here, and here, and, um, so they end up going with Mopar and them and stuff like that. And I'm saying, I'm pretty much sitting here going like, okay. Um, I'm mainly trying to do these events. I'm trying to be on for the events. I joined Trap pretty much almost two or one to two times a week, which is you can only do three. A week, well, three and a half or whatever, but it doesn't start. It's two day cooldown time. Anyways, <clears throat> so I'm pretty much on trying to do trap. You know, I'm sitting there pretty much trying to at work, you know, fucking around on my phone, which I shouldn't be trying to help them do trap. I'm pretty much risking my job to do a trap and they complain because I'm not doing the events. Well, at this point, I was like, whatever, I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to take, you know, this and, and stuff. So I just like ended up like, okay, whatever, um, sure. But there's like a lot of people who, who's apocalypse, who is, you know, who am I? He's not even on anymore, blah, blah, blah. You know, all those things, you know, that doubt, leadership, blah, blah, blah. You know, just to kick out the leader, you know, that type of stuff. That's pretty much what ended up happening. But they left. I'm, I didn't care. I was like, if, if they tried 
asking for a leader or whatever. I'll just say, uh, go fuck yourself. Just leave. Because I'm not going to give it to you. I'm not. I don't need to be on 24 fucking hours of the fucking day just to do events to have your fucking satisfaction on that. That's pretty much what it came down to. Like, that's what it felt to me. When they blindsided me, they don't give me the time of day. I mean, <clears throat> in between... Um, in between what Mopar said and Z Ripper, then after what he said was, um, it's it's hard to message you. I'm like, I'm sitting here. It's not like I didn't say this. I mean, I didn't message in the Discord when this was going on. I didn't, I didn't do this. I didn't message this because I would have flat out just fucking raped their assholes with my words at this point. Like I was done. I was pissed off. I didn't care. Like, I was p really pissed. Like, at the point, I was pretty heated. There's a lot of words, I you know, a lot of things I shouldn't have really said, I guess, to make it worse, whatever. I don't care. Anyways, and um, I really wanted to say it. And she said, well, it's really hard to message you. I'm like, it's not hard to take 10 seconds of your fucking life to message me. To s even say hi or how are you. Or any details about state versus state, reservoir raid, blah blah blah. It's not that hard. Like, how hard is it gonna take 10 seconds of your fucking life to do that shit? Oh, sorry about my luck screen. Anyways, um, so that that that's what put me to the edge to where I didn't give a fuck. That's what flipped my switch and I pretty much said fuck you like that's where I was at like I um, was done I'm like I don't even care like that's pretty much what you're telling me I don't care about you that's what you're saying to me if you're telling me it's hard to message me you're telling me that you don't care about me at this point I stopped caring for them. I pretty much did. Because when I got on, that's what I was looking for. I was looking to talk to them, you know, be friendly and shit. And that's what I was looking for for everybody. That's what I was totally looking for. Every time I got on, that's what I was looking for is to talk to them. But, you know, here we are. <laughs> I should say, here I am. Anyways... So it got to that point. I was pretty upset. I pissed, of course. Who wouldn't it be? But um, it really sucks. Like, they pretty much stabbed me in the back. Like, then they started poaching other people. Probably telling pretty good lies. Stuff like that. I don't... Um, I've told them, I don't care what you fucking do you want to tell me these lies you want to tell people these lies that are not true go for it if that makes you feel better go for it like there's a lot of things i want to say to them that is pretty dark and cruel i mean that's how i am like when i'm really really pissed if you want to, like, take rumors and take lies and do me dirty like that, that's... Uh, I will turn around and you're gonna face the dark side of me and you wish you never had. Like, that's where it's coming to. Like, I mean... I'll say a couple things. I'm not gonna really mean this. Like, I really don't mean this. I don't wish this. I don't nothing just this is just like what i would say if someone's really that low like really pathetic low like um <clears throat> when people start rumors for no reason um stuff like that and my side of revenge is pretty much dark pretty dark wishing they die wishing that you get killed by somebody else like that type of stuff um that you're a faggot and you shouldn't be saying these rumors that are not true 
Like, stuff like that. That's where it comes to in my mind. Like, that's what I think. But I don't say. That's, that's, it's cruel. Either way, if I say it, it's still, it's fucked up. It's cruel. That's why I don't say it. I mean, I may think that. I'm not going to say it, though. Like, I may think that way. And I'm, no, there's a lot of you probably hate me after this, but I don't care. But that's how my brain thinks. Like, that's how I think. Like, if you want to start lies and rumors and shit like that and pretty much backstab me and stuff like that, that's what I think about you afterwards. And, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty dark when it comes to that shit like that. It's because you... If you take the time to build friendship with someone and they turn around and do that to you, what would you do? Would you do the same thing? Would you think the same thing? Like, you're a fucking asshole. I've been your friend for forever. Then you have the nerve to tell me that it's hard to message you. Like, that's pretty much saying go fuck yourself. Like, it's really bad. Like, really. Like, you, it's got pretty pretty bad i mean there is like a few people i mean there's like one person i don't know who who manny's from manny i don't know who, what alliance he's from he's in the same state and say we're cutting ties with your alliance blah 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 whatever uh they're following mopar I'm like i don't know who the fuck you are and i don't care you never message back that's exactly what i said like i don't know who the fuck you are and I don't really care. And I also, yeah, I also added that you want to follow a bunch of power-hungry motherfuckers. That's exactly what I said. Because that's what they are about. Like, in my eyes, that's what I see. But, you know, here I am. i just doing my video um, and stuff. Uh... And like I said, if you guys have stayed this far, I'm pretty happy. I'm sorry, because you're hearing all this. But, again, I told you, this is my story. This is what's been going on for the past three months. Anyways, so, on to that. So I got a few messages, you know, that one message from that person. Never responded back. I don't know if he read it. I don't know if you got pissed off to the point where you didn't want to message me back. I mean, I, I'm, I'm pretty flipped out on him. I didn't care. <laughs> I didn't know who that person was. I tried finding them in the game. I took like two hours trying to, trying to find him and I couldn't find him. So obviously different names. So I don't know what alliance or anything. Anyways, so... Uh, so pretty much after our discussion, our whole blown discussion about in the Discord, which I'll probably have a part two video uh, about this with all the Discord talks. I was pretty heated. I was saying the wrong things that I didn't want to say and um, pretty much complained a lot about in the Discord about it. Um, told them communication is really all I need. I you know, it's not hard to say, hey, we're doing this for, you know, state for state or capital clash, whatever, you know. I get barely none of that except for when they're trying to announce it to everyone. Like, that's all I get. But, yeah, it was pretty bad. Let me take a drink real quick. I'm talking way too much. Anyways... Um, so then it got to, uh, that point and that's where it ended, ended up in like the last, ne next week they left, which was the last state for the state. <clears throat> so, yeah. <laughs> so it's been a good while since they left at this point. I don't really care. I've seen people... You know, hanging in this alliance, I do appreciate it and stuff like that. But they saw, like, the real side of me. Like, I work. 
I come on when I can. I do the events when it's scheduled that I can do, you know, that type of stuff. But, like, Mopar has never messaged me, not even at the beginning. He barely messaged me. Like, that's what it felt like, just like with Buster. He's a Marine person, he, you know, he's in the service, I can understand that. But then when you tell me that I can't pretty much do the same, that's pretty fucked up. Like, that's where it got to. <clears throat> but, yeah, so it's a lot to say and it's a lot to take in, really. And, yeah, it got pretty bad really really bad like i was at the point where i don't know i just don't know anyways i'll probably end up doing another video about this to cover the rest and but when i want to get to the end of this video here i don't know how long i've been recording but my phone's about to die uh but anyways so we're gonna move on to the official Discord server with uh, State of Survival and what I do as a content creator. So, there's a lot of things that's been going on with that too. A lot of heated stuff with other people that I I saw, but it's not really necessarily to talk about because it's not have to do with anything about my story. So this is gonna be my story for this. Well, one day they finally created Content Creator Discord for just the content creators for State of Survival, which was cool. It's kind of handy, you know. They can get in other people that they probably do work with too as well. And, you know, that you know it's all cool. Then, uh, then we, in the official um, State of Survival Discord where everybody can join... There's a section where we can post our videos or streams or anything like that. Um, for the longest times, there was no rules on posting the videos. It's only just state of survival videos. Like that was the only rule. Now it kept changing and changing. Um, uh, there was like there was things that no promoting other Discord servers or other sites. Blah blah blah. I mean that was pretty much in general. Now, uh, you know how we have a description on our videos. It has links to our Discord and other things. Well, apparently that's not allowed and posted in the videos. So I can't have any links to any other Discord or unofficial site from, uh, from State of Survival. And it has to be straight the app itself. Or the state of survival, uh, you know, community page on uh, Facebook. I can't really pronounce that right for some reason. But it, that, it was like, I'm like, okay, this person on there named the Great Oracle. Um, I have fought him for a good he or she, I should say. I don't know. It, it was pretty heated. It's probably he, but. Um, for a good two hours. I, I pretty much, you know, told my thing, blah, blah, blah. Well, <clears throat> I told them I was going to take it up with uh, um, the people I work with. You know, you know, tell them about it, blah, blah, blah. And I did. So what they were saying is that having links in the Discord, I mean, in the video description is promoting other Discord servers and other sites. I'm sitting here going like, it's not promoting, stop fucking deleting my videos. I mean, I didn't say fucking, but I said stop deleting my videos, all in caption, everything. You know, yelling, screaming, whatever you want to do. And and then he pretty much tells me, follow the rules. I'm like, uh, uh, follow your own rules, dumbass. Like, in my head, of course, I didn't say it in <laughs> the whole Discord, but I said it in his DMs. <laughs> I was pretty heated. I was pretty mad. Like, and I told him, I mean, I told him, it's like, just look at this. How is it promoting? If it's in your own, on your own channel, in your own channel, in your own video, 
and it's in the description of your own video. How is that promoting? It's not saying anything. Like, it's just in your description, sitting there. Free will. It's just floating. Bubbling. Just, it's just there. Everybody's got a chance to, you know, tap on the link if they want to. You know, it's not forcing anything. It's not doing anything. It's just there for convenience. For you. For everybody who wants it. Now, she's saying that's promoting. It's like I told her, so look at this. It's not promoting. Saying this is what I'm going to about to say is promoting. Hey, come join my Discord server and put up a link. That's promoting. Doing it multiple times is spamming, of course. You all guys know this. Well, yeah. So apparently having my links in the Discord is pretty much promoting other shit. I mean, I mean, links in my video is pretty much promoting other shit. Now, I'm seeing that there's a few other videos that are still up there that's, you know, posted in official Discord of State of Survival is still up there. Been up there for weeks. But he's this nagging on me. I'm like, okay. He started this before me with some other content creator i don't know the name i pretty much forgot because i pretty much stopped i turned off all notifications to this discord server i was done i fought this dude for two hours telling them everything what is promoting but still choose to ignore me so so i took it up with the people that uh you know, I explained it, blah, blah, blah. But they still told me, you got to follow the rules. I'm like, really? Can't even have a simple discussion of, like, why this is wrong. And they're abusing their power and stuff like that. I was pretty angry. I was done. And, um... <sighs> and they tell us, like, weeks later or whatever, after I get done doing my rant... Saying that uh, if you're not in the official Discord server, you're technically not a content creator and they will kick you out. Uh, they will final sign the contract, whatever. Anyways, um, then I made a few suggestions you know, throughout the months that this has been going on. Now, I've been recently getting other people that, like that are pretty much friends like the maniac that I have um, as my YouTube bestie and uh, you know a few of them having the same problem uh, it wasn't him that did message this it was some other person and um, <clears throat> uh, saying having the same problem and I put up you know a little little talk about you know uh, some simple fact here saying if we have to be in we're supposed to be in the official discord server for the state of survival like for with the everybody in it um, then why should we be there if we can't post anything if they're gonna just take it down and the same person replied exactly that had the same problems like me said exactly I'm like it's like proves my point like why do we have to be in the same discord server as you know have to be in it or we get kicked from the content creator shit if our posts are just gonna get taken down just like that like it makes no sense but you know no one wants to talk about it so here we are I'm talking about it <laughs> so so it's getting pretty pretty messed up like there's everything has changed everything is they're they're picking they're doing something i don't know what they're doing but they're doing something it's pretty pathetic it's pretty sad they're abusing their power they obviously don't like certain people they're fucking retards <laughs> and there's a lot of things i could say like really really a lot of mean things I could say anyways um, so that's pretty much as what's been going on with everything that's been going on for the past three or four months at least three months for the first part 
I mean like the first start of the video. <laughs> Last part has been going on for four months. But anyways, guys, I hope you kind of enjoy this video. Um, sorry to say that uh, you don't like this video or not or whatever. <laughs> anyways, hope you guys enjoy this. Stay tuned and I'll see you guys in the next one.